Hello everyone! Welcome back to Singer Family Adventures! My name is Valerie and this great big gray fuzzball is Biscuits. Are you the Bis Bis? Yes! He's one of our little loves here. So today I am bringing you the so Today, I am bringing you the Simplifying Swaps video. The Simplifying Swaps video. Um, <clears throat> this is a tag that was created by Erica Diocampo, and it is really a video done by Disney YouTubers meant for other Disney YouTubers. So basically, I'm going to be talking about what are the items that I would most love to have in a swap box? What categories of items? We do a lot of swaps in the Disney YouTube world. I think I have 23 scheduled for 2020, eight of them that I'm organizing and the rest that other people have organized. Um, so that's a lot. So this is to help other people who are doing swaps with me. Okay. Um, I'm not just asking for people to send me stuff, but I am talking about the kind of stuff I'd love to be sent. All right. So thank you, Erica, for coming up with this and um, I was asked to do this and asked to do this in a couple of swaps because it does make it easier for the person who's buying you your swap box and you don't know who that person is. In most swaps it's a secret Santa almost type thing. So um, it gives people a good idea of, of what you like. All right, <clears throat> there are a number of questions and they're on my computer. First questions, favorite characters that you would enjoy, that you would like on any merchandise, no matter what type of merchandise. All right, I would say Stitch, Stitch and Stitch. I would also say Eeyore. If you didn't watch my old stuff video, I'm gonna link it here. Um, Stitch, Eeyore, Princess or General Leia. Um, I am a huge fan, of, well, of course the Aristocats. Not so much Marie by herself because I'm not a super pinky girly girl type person. Um, I do like Marie, but my real love from the Aristocats is Berlioz, of course. And I really like when you've got two or three or five of them on something. Um, so any kind of merchandise with them on it. I also really like Alice in Wonderland quite a lot. Um, I like the Cheshire Cat. I like animals in general, so um, I really like Lady of Lady and the Tramp. I used to have a dog named Lady. And um, the 101 Dalmatians. So I would say Stitch, Eeyore, Leia, and then all these other folks. Uh, my favorite villain is Maleficent. When it comes to villains, always Maleficent. Um, <clears throat> Next question. Favorite movie you like on any merchandise, no matter what? That's an interesting and difficult one. Again, I would say Stitch. I would also say I really love Star Wars. Um, so the three original Star Wars or the three last Star Wars, meaning not those crappy prequels, but, um, you know, the 70s Star Wars or the 2000s Star Wars. I would enjoy any merchandise with that. Although I will say out of that, I am definitely on the resistance Jedi side. I am not on the dark side. The only exception to that would be Kylo Ren because, you know, really Ben Solo is a good guy when it comes down to it. Um, so types of merchandise that you are always wanting. Um, first and foremost, pins, pins, and more pins. Love my pins. I am slowly getting into more like limited edition pins and specific things than just beautiful pins in general, but I love beautiful pins in general. I do not collect fantasy pins. I actually only have one, and that is one that somebody sent to me, but I love it because it's super cool. Um, I would say in terms of fantasy pins, it needs to be like extra special. I don't just want fantasy pins. I want actual Disney traders. Um, the other kind of merchandise that I really love, I, I've become addicted to these little wishables. It's Minnie! Um, I love the wishables. I really enjoy them. Uh, the only set of wishables that I have all of are the cruise wishables. Um, 
and I know they're just going to keep coming out with more sets. If you're sending me a swap box and you just need one more thing to put in it and you don't know what, send me a Wishable. I will be very happy. I especially love the mini ones. Um, I do love mini. I'm getting more and more into mini. Um, favorite attractions slash parks? Do you like merchandise from these? Um, I mean, Animal Kingdom, Galaxy's Edge, or Hollywood Studios, really Galaxy's Edge, and then Magic Kingdom are my favorite parks. I don't really have the favorite. Um, I do love Space Mountain. I do love um, um, Everest and Rise of the Resistance. So, um, you know, those are all good ones. Uh, I'm not as much into the merchandise that's connected to an actual attraction. Um, I do love cruise merchandise. I'd call cruising an attraction, so I certainly love cruise mer merchandise. Um, the collection I want to grow the most is certainly my pins collection, and I would say out of that, again, like limited edition pins of Star Wars, Aristocrats, Princess and the Frog. Is this weird? Mm -hmm. Joan is walking away in the background. Um, I'm not here, ignore me. Ignore him. Um, I hope this is helpful. I also collect a little bit of Winnie the Pooh pins, a little bit of um, Cheshire Cat and Alice in Wonderland pins, um, and definitely stitch pins. Um, so, if you're unsure about my collections or have a question on something I might already have, please reach out to these friends. Now, I have a number of friends, I feel like, in the Disney community, but not anybody who's been to my house, not anybody that like knows my collections inside and out. Um, those are cats in the background. I'll name a couple people. Um, I would say Danita from Absolutely Fabulous, um, Melody of Princess Melody, uh, I think Tiffy of Hello Tiffy Bell knows what I like quite, quite well. Um, who else? There was a couple other people. Oh, uh, maybe uh, Jody and Laura Life. Those are folks that I do talk to a good bit, and um, they could certainly all just come up to me and say, hey, somebody asked me to ask you, blah, blah, blah. You know, um, the person who knows my collection is Jonah. Um, I could link his Instagram. Can I link your Instagram? Yeah. What? What? So somebody can message you if they have a question. Sure. Sure. Reluctant teenager. I will link Jonah's Instagram below. Um, I don't know that he wants to connect to everybody in the world, but you can always message him. Um, so merchandise to avoid when shopping for me. Oh, I wanted to go back to the collections I want to grow the most. Besides wishables and pins, I would say next would be um, Jim Shore. I love, I, I have four Jim Shores right now. really love them though, and I would be always happy to get a nice Jim Shore. Um, I like Funko Pops a lot. I don't have a lot of them. Um, there's two big ones that I really wish I had bought for myself and didn't. One is the, um, the Skyliner one. So I guess that's my exception in terms of attractions. I love the Skyliner merch. And then the other one is the large Maleficent dragon, which I didn't, I could have gotten that super on sale. Um, um, I also really like stationery or journals. My boys like that sort of thing too. Um, my boys are big Marvel fans and Star Wars fans. And, um, oh, I am always happy to get handcrafted stuff. I love the ears that um, I've been sent that were made uh, by, you know, that are homemade as opposed to the Disney ears. So I'm always happy for more ears. I'm not as intensely an ear collector as some people, but I'm merchandise to avoid when shopping for me. I would say, again, I'm not a super girly girl. So um, I'm not a super princessy person. I will then name several exceptions. So I'm you know, there are princesses that I feel more drawn to, but I'm not automatically a princess type person. Um, so the princesses I'm drawn to are number one, Princess Leia. Um, and then 
I do really like Tiana from Princess and the Frog. I just recently watched Moana and that is such a good movie. It's an amazing movie. So I think I might be getting a little deeper into Moana merch again. Um, when I was a girl, my favorite princess was always Snow White, and so she has a special place in my heart. Um, and I, I do think Merida just kicks butt. Um, <clears throat> so I would say I'm also not like very much into makeup and beauty products, um, so that would not be my first choice. The beauty products that um, people have sent me in swaps I've enjoyed, but I would never sort of reach out for them. The exception to that might be soaps. I do like nice soap, um, kind of handcrafted soap, and I do like skin lotion, nice, you know, good smelling lotions. But other than that, I'm not so into the beauty products, not so into the fantasy pins. What else am I not into? Um, popcorn buckets. Popcorn buckets to me, are just a waste of space in my house. I, I do think they're cool, but I really enjoy watching other people get them. I really can appreciate them and say, that is so cool, but I don't want to start having a collection of popcorn bucket, buckets. Um, in terms of merch to avoid for me, I would also say we are Jewish, so we don't do Christmas ornaments. Um, there are so many hundreds of fabulous Disney Christmas ornaments out there Getting more into Disney has made me a little sad that we don't have a Christmas tree, but we're not going to start having a Christmas tree just to hang up Disney ornaments. Um, <clears throat> so I would say go light on Christmas merch. There's some Christmas merch I really enjoy. I enjoy Christmas pins, but go light on Christmassy stuff. If you see Hanukkah stuff, that's always... Um, all about accessories. Um, you cannot go wrong with me with jewelry. I love jewelry. I love earrings and necklaces and um, love Alex and Ani um, or anything like that kind of uh, bracelets. I'm more on the silver side than the gold side or rose gold. They're not my colors, more silver. Um, my favorite color is green and um, spill any and all other additional information here in terms of what it would be helpful to tell you about me. I love candy, love chocolate, not very picky with those things. I'm not crazy about sour stuff, but my kids are. So I'm super happy if you send sour candy because then my kids are super happy. Um, we all like stickers here, so stickers are good. Um, that's always like a fun, just little add on to things is, is stickers. Um, what else? What other information should I be telling you? I'm pausing for a minute. We like art. We like art postcards. We, both my boys are artistic, so any kind of like art supply type thing, um, you know, they love that sort of thing and, and I love it. So um, anything artistically focused is something that we would enjoy. We do love small shop stuff. Anytime you can buy from a homemade person, super appreciated on this end. Um, I know that fantasy pins are kind of my exception to that. It's not that I don't want fantasy pins, it's that if I want a fantasy pin, it needs to not just fit into my collection, but be its own work of art. Does that make sense? Um, I hope this is helpful. I feel weird doing this video. I didn't do this video for a while because I feel like it's almost like, give me, give me, give me, and I don't want to be like that. And I, That's not why I'm in the Disney community, although these swaps are super, super fun, and I appreciate that people want to get things that someone's really gonna like. I will say, as I'm holding this Minnie, since I now have a cat named Minnie, I've gotten more and more into Minnie the character as well, and, I will also say that anything cat related or dog related, always welcome in this household, always. And um, I'm not going to tag anyone specific. A lot of people have done this tag. I will say if you are involved in one of my summer swaps this summer and have not done this tag, then I am tagging you. Please do it. I will also say that I do have two of my summer swaps still open. Um, we'll probably be organizing and assigning and closing them soon, and that is the Disney Animal Lovers Swap, which is going to be July 30th, 
and then just a general Disney box swap, which is going to be August 6th. So um, thank you so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Nobody has to send me anything, but I, and I love everything that's ever been sent to me. And um, I just hope this helps out. So please go spread a little kindness in the world and please stay healthy and see y'all real soon. What was that? That was weird. Go. Are we ready? Okay. Welcome back everyone to Singer Family Adventures. Man. Mm -hmm. Welcome back. This is Singer Family Adventures and I'm Valerie and this is Minnie and that was weird. You're off your game today. I'm off my game today. Crap. Okay. You. Oh, excuse me. Do you need help? Hi, welcome back everyone to Singer Family Adventures. My name is Valerie and if you're new here, welcome. This is going to be a slightly odd first video to see, but if you're returning, welcome back. So glad you're here. So glad you're here even if you're new. Whatever. Nah. Start over. Would you like help? I need help. <laughs> That's good help. That's a prop. That's the kind of 